All right, today we're going to start talking about factors. All right, factors is a very important multiplication term that you need to know. A factor is one of the numbers you multiply to get a product, and the product means your answer in a multiplication equation. All right, so right here, 3 is a factor. This is a factor. 4 is a factor. But if you hear the word factor pair, that means you're talking about two numbers you multiply to get a product. So the factor pair for three times four would be three and four. This is your factor pair. Right, so when we are trying to find our factors, one strategy we like to use in fourth grade is called a factor tree, right? So a factor tree is just simply a T-chart. There's no fancy leaves or anything on it, all right? So what you do is you look for your factor. We are going to be finding all the factors or factor pairs for 24. 24 is your product. Okay, this is what 24 is. That is the product. We are trying to find all the numbers we can multiply to get to 24, all right? So I'm just going to start with one and 24. One is always going to be your first factor. And whatever the product is, is the other factor. You will always work this way because you can always do one time that number to get the product. Okay, so now I've got to start listing all the ones that I know I can multiply. I know two times 12 gives me 24. I know three times eight gives me 24. Okay, I'm going to continue this process. Is there any time times 4 that will give me 24? Yes. Okay, 4 times 6 will give me 24. All right, let's talk about 5. I know 5 times 4 is 20, and I know 5 times 5 is 25. You do not want to go over your product. Okay, my product is 24. So if I said 5 times 5, I've gone over. If I say 4 times Five, I am under. So I know five is not a, a factor I can use. All right, so now I'm at six. I do not need to rewrite six. I already have six on my board. I have completed my factor tree. Right now, I have one times 24, two times 12, three times eight, and four times six. Okay, these are my factor pairs for the product of that for 24. All right, so I have several ways I can write this. I can sit here and write the factors of 24, and I can simply write them go down this way and then go up on this side, okay? This is going to be called your factor rainbow or factor arc, okay? So you can go one, two, three, four, six, 8, 12, and 24. It is called an arc or rainbow because I could sit here and say 1 and 24. I could say 2 and 12 and so forth. Okay. If I wanted to say one of the factor pairs, I could say one of the factor pairs is 2 and 12. Another factor pair is 4 and 6. Today we are talking about factors and factor trees, and we are going to practice finding the factors of different numbers.